Hey YouTube, it's your girl Shay P back with another video and today's video will be something different. I will be starting my entrepreneur series. This is episode one and this episode will be titled How I Made 10K in One Month by Selling Sunglasses. <laughs> do let's get right into this video and i'll be giving you guys all of my tips and advice that i believe most definitely helped me reach my goals and help my business expand and grow and i'm just gonna tell you guys how it is okay and i'll be getting my notes from my ipad today so let's get right into this video number one passion leads to success make sure that you are selling a product or an item that you are truly passionate about and that goes for all type of work just like people say people who work a job that that they're more passionate about they're more happy because you're doing something that you love and when you do something that you love it is easier to work around everything so if you're selling a product or an item that you love you will be able to brand it and promote it very more passionately because it is something that you are strong you strongly feel about and something that you will buy yourself make sure that you are selling products that you will purchase yourself because if you wouldn't purchase it why would someone else buy it from you so always keep that in mind make sure you're passionate about what you sell and show that passion because that is what really gets you customers. Because they want to know why they should buy your product or your item. Why is it worth it? And you have to show them why it is. So next one is quality scenery attracts customers and followers. So when you take professional quality photos and take your time with your photos, it will will in a lot of followers especially when you use the right hashtags, which is another tip, which I know you guys have probably heard many other times if you watch other videos like this. Hashtags are important, and it's important to find hashtags that work for you, hashtags that you can see from your post review, from your impressions and all that, your reach. If your hashtag has really helped, you can see how many times people have seen it. So you will be able to figure out what hashtags are not working. So it's basically trial and error. You're going to try some and maybe that photo didn't do so bad, so, so good. And then you probably tried some new hashtags, your next photo, and you gotten many more likes, followers from the hashtag, and even possibly... With quality photos, you can possibly end up on Explore as well, which is what we want to successfully grow our business because we want to be able to have the ability to promote our business without having to always pay for promotion. Once you're able to be on Explore, you are attracting people for free and you're attracting people that are possibly into your products. That's what our Explorers are for. They are designed for our desires so if you're on someone's explore it is possibly you are going to gain a follower and possibly a customer so quality scenery matters and to tag on to that another advice i like to give to people when they ask me is to try different type of techniques of photos of your quality photos so for example, sometimes I take photos of my sunglasses on fur fabric or I'll take it outdoor in like a nice like scenery, natural outdoor lighting and etc. Sometimes I take it on myself and sometimes I post my customers and my product for me to promote. It is important to be diverse with how you promote your product because different ways attract different customers. For an example, maybe the fur material may attract older to young adults. Maybe the outdoor scenery attracts young adults and teenagers. So even videos, TikToks, tutorials, try different stuff because 
it'll attract different type of customers and we want all type of customers we don't want to limit our customers we want to have anybody shop with us that is a goal in running a business so my next tip is which is something i learned from another youtuber that i did and it really helped me a lot once i started doing this purchase your inventory all at the end of the month and buy enough inventory to last you the whole new month that's coming up so let's break that down reasons why that is pros about that many pros about that are that you're able to see your profit for that month when you're not going back every week or every other week buying new inventory inventory buying more shipping stuff buying more business cards instead of doing that like every other week or every week you can have your income pile up and really see how much you can make with your products two customers always especially your popular items they have to always be in stock because that's how you get sales if you know something is very popular have a large amount of so that it can last longer on your website and more people will shop because when your items are sold out people tend to probably really wanted it then so it is likely they may wait but it's very likely they may go to the next small business who is selling it that has it in stock so it was good to have enough you need so you do not go out of stock as fast as possible okay like me i wait till like the last sunday of the month or two weeks before the month ends and order everything i need for the next month like it comes like the first or a day before or a couple of days before the month begins so i prepare myself and i restock all my inventory so it is very organizing but guys trust me if you do it you will see a raise in your income by a lot okay because your money is not being too disturbed by going back and buying more inventory last one actually last one be you stay original and stay true to yourself it is easy to want to view the next successful person and want to be just like them. So you may tend to, instead of being inspired by them, copy them. Do not do that. Guys, a big key to running a successful business and most importantly, expanding your business is bringing something that is very unique that will draw people to your page. When people are on Instagram, a lot of the times they are looking for pages that they can be entertained by. If your page is bringing, it, it brings a lot of like entertainment and it looks very welcoming, people can spend up to minutes and close to an hour on your page. Because I know if there's a page that's really like cute and organized and it has a lot of photos and a lot of different type of photos, I will really like sit there and look through it if it's really worth looking through. Do your own thing. Do not copy other people because people won't want to really follow you because there's nothing unique about what you do that makes them want to follow you or make them want to stay on your page for hours or lead to make them not wanting to shop with you. So do something that's unique. Take the time to sit down and write down creative ideas on different ways to promote your business it's it's very important to really try different skills to promote your business because people like to see spontaneous things people like to see new things people like to see interesting things on social media which leads to them wanting to go on their web your website and eventually really shop with you i know i said that was the last key but one more thing is being as professional as you possibly can or just be professional period answer emails within a 24-hour range it's really good to answer emails as fast as possible and or if you accept dms or any type of messaging because one it shows the customers that you are professional you're running a business smoothly because you have fast response etc response to emails professionally because people really like that and they will shop with you again.
and they will spread good words about you for other people around to shop with you as well. So please let me know if these tips help any of you guys out or even a little bit. If you have any more questions, com comment down below. Let me know. But I hope to make more entrepreneur videos. I will be making more and I hope you guys like these videos. That is it. for Actually, no, I have one more thing to do. I wanted to show you guys. I don't know if this video will be edited before or after I drop this, but I want to show you guys my new, new products. My new items, actually. My new items. They just came in and I am in love. I am in love. Shay's Collection is adding new items to our site. So I want to show y'all. So y'all can see. Yes, so I do already sell bonnets. I sell double-sided double sided silk solid color bonnets and purple, light purple, silver, black, and pink, burgundy. But now I'm going to be selling these designer bonnets. And oh my God, they're so cute and stretchy and they feel very like silk this is so cute like this is cute like period so this is the chanel in black and so we have our pink louis vuitton printed let me let that focus louis vuitton printed uh bonnet I almost said scarf this is so pretty like this is so pretty so this will be available on the website um if i have the date i'll put it right here or if it's already dropped i'll put it down below these babies are so cute i can't wait to model them i can't wait but thank you for watching this video i love you guys see you in my next video bye